Ever wondered how the banking system works? It's a question that has undoubtedly crossed your mind at one point or another. The banking system is a fascinating web of institutions and processes, all working in synchrony to facilitate financial transactions and provide an assortment of financial services. At its very core, a bank is an intermediary, a middleman if you will, between depositors and borrowers. Imagine a scenario where individuals or businesses deposit their money into a bank. These funds are then pooled together to generate a hefty sum of capital. Banks, in turn, use a portion of these deposits to lend to other individuals or businesses, charging an interest on these loans. This system stimulates economic activity by granting people access to funds beyond their immediate savings. Banks also play a critical role in payment systems. Picture a world where money transfers between different parties are facilitated through various mechanisms such as checks, electronic transfers, and credit debit cards. That's the banking world for you. And it doesn't stop there. Banks offer a plethora of financial products and services, including savings and checking accounts, loans, mortgages, and investment products. The financial stability and regulatory oversight of banks are not just important, but essential to maintain public trust and prevent systemic risks. This brings us to the role of central banks. Take the Federal Reserve in the United States, for example. Central banks regularly regulate and oversee the banking system to ensure stability and control monetary policy. These institutions may set interest rates, influence the money supply, and intervene during financial crises. Let's not forget about technology. Technological advancements have completely transformed the banking landscape. The introduction of online banking, mobile apps, and digital currencies have reshaped how individuals interact with financial institutions. Yet despite these changes, the fundamental principles of the banking system, such as deposits, loans, and intermediation, remain central to its functioning. To summarize, the banking system is a network of institutions and processes that facilitate financial transactions and provide varied financial services. Banks act as intermediaries between depositors and borrowers, stimulating economic activity. They also facilitate payment systems and offer a range of financial products and services. Central banks, on the other hand, regulate the banking system, ensure stability, control monetary policy, and intervene during crises. And while technology continues to revolutionize the way we bank, the fundamental principles of the system remain unchanged. So the next time you deposit a check or transfer money via an app, remember, there's a complex yet fascinating system at work behind the scenes, making it all possible. Now isn't that something to marvel at?